Hi guys, welcome to our first virtual campfire. We're so excited to be able to spend the evening with you this way. We really wish that we could do something in person and we could encourage you guys uh, with hugs and with hot chocolate, but um, times being as they are, this is what we get to do tonight and we're excited about that as well. Um, we've got a really great lineup for you guys tonight. So we've got our LIT director, Austin, and some of the IVCF campus interns. They're gonna do a skit for us. Um, the senior girls directors and some other friends have put together some silly songs. And Hogan, our senior boys director, is going to share a little bit from the Word of God with us. And so we're really excited about that. Um, and if you are uh, watching this uh, as it premieres with us, you can comment in the live chat and we'll comment back. We're just really excited to spend the evening with you guys this way. So here we go. Hey everybody, Jenny. And I'm Mason. And we're going to do some campfire songs for you today with our oh, own campfire, campfire in our house. There was a great, great big moose. He liked to drink a lot of juice. There was a great, great big moose. He liked to drink a lot of juice. Singing way oh way oh. Way oh way oh way oh way oh. Singing way oh way oh. Way oh way oh way oh way oh. The moose's name was Fred. He liked to drink his juice in bed. The moose's name was Fred. He liked to drink his juice in bed. Singing way oh way oh, way oh way oh way oh way oh. Singing way oh way oh, way oh way oh way oh way oh. He drank his juice with care, but he spilled it in his hair. He drank his juice with care, but he spilled it in his hair. Singing way oh way oh. Way oh way oh way oh way oh, singing way oh way oh, way oh way oh way oh way oh. Go. Oh my God! I just I need some important papers. I need the important papers, and I don't have them. I just need them. I need them right now. I just need the important papers. Excuse me, sir. Do you have any important papers? Oh, I have my essay on TikTok and how it's going to revolutionize society. I don't need that. I don't need that. Work really oh, hard on it. I need, I need some important papers. I need important papers. I need some right now. Oh, if I don't get them, I don't know what I'm going to do. Excuse me, sir. Sir, do you have any important papers that I could have? Do you have any important just, papers? Just take it. Don't, don't hurt me. I don't need this. Oh, my Mom, goodness. I just got lost. I need important papers. Oh, my goodness, sir. Do you have any important papers? Yeah, it's five. It was just five dollars. There's nothing I'm in sorry. there. Oh, my goodness. I just, I need, I need the important papers if I don't get them soon. I don't, Oh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, sir, sir, do you have any important papers? I have this phone book. What's a phone book? No, oh, I need some important papers. I need them, I need them right now. Oh, if I don't get them, I'm starting to feel it. Oh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know what, I need some important papers. Do you yeah, have? Is, is this what you're looking for? Yes, thank you. Oh, oh my goodness. Forty years in an iceberg. Forty years in an iceberg. Bopping along with the tide. Bopping along with the tide. Nothing to wear but pajamas. Nothing to wear but pajamas. Nothing to do but slide. Nothing to do but slide. The air is getting colder. The air is getting colder. The wind is beginning to bite. The wind is beginning to bite. I think I'm gonna go out. I think I'm gonna go out. And have a horsey tonight. Have a horsey tonight. Forty years in an iceberg. Body is an iceberg. Popping along with the tide. Popping along with the tide. Nothing to wear but pajamas. Nothing to wear but pajamas. Nothing to do but slide. Nothing to do but slide. The air is getting colder. The air is getting colder. The wind is beginning to bite. The wind is beginning to bite. I think I'm gonna go out. I think I'm gonna go out. And hack a cat tonight. Give me down. Forty years in an iceberg. Forty years in an iceberg. Popping along with the tide. Nothing to wear but pajamas. Nothing to wear but pajamas. Nothing to do but slide. Nothing to do but slide. The air is getting colder. The air is getting colder. The wind is beginning to bite. The wind is beginning to bite. I think I'm gonna go out. I think I'm gonna go out. And hug a dog tonight. Forty years in an iceberg. Forty years in an iceberg. Bopping along with the tide. Bopping along with the tide. Nothing to wear but pajamas. Nothing to do but slide. The air is getting colder. The wind is beginning to bite. The wind is beginning to bite. Think I'm gonna go out. And have a snowbank tonight. 
nice. Yeah. <laughs> Hi guys. We're going to do a senior girl's favorite campfire song. Even more fun because we're in the snow. So follow <laughs> along if you know the song. Down by the old mill stream where I first met you with your eyes so blue dressed in gingham too it was there I knew that I loved you true you were 16 my village queen down by the old mill stream down by the old not the new but the old mill stream not the river but the stream where i first not the second but the first met you not me but you with Just your eyes not your nose, nose but your eyes so, so blue not green but blue Dressed in gingham, not satin, but gingham. Two, not one, but two. It was there, I right hear, but there. I knew, not thought, but knew. That I liked, not liked, but loved. You, true, not false, but true. You were 16, not 17, but 16. My village queen, not the king, but the queen. Down by the old, not the new, but the old. Mill stream, not the river, but the stream. It's a little cold, which is why we're speeding up. Down by, by the, the new mill river, where I second, second met me. With, with my nose, nose so green, dressed in satin one. It was here I thought that I liked me false. You were 17, 17. <laughs> my village king, down so by the new, new mill river. <laughs> Hi everybody, my name is Hogan, and some of you probably know me as the director of Senior Boys and some other camps you might have come to, and I have been given the great privilege of sharing the word of God with you. Right now I'd love for you to flip to Matthew 7. I'm going to read from verses 24 to 27. If you're watching this video, I know you have the capability of Googling that, so go ahead and do that right now. Hit the pause button. And now that you're back, why don't we go ahead and read it together. It says, Therefore, everyone who hears these words of mine and puts them into practice is like a wise man who built his house on the rock. The rain came down, the streams rose, and the winds blew and beat against that house. Yet it did not fall, because it had its foundation on the rock. But everyone who hears these words of mine and does not put them into practice is like a foolish man who built his house on sand. The rain came down, the streams rose, and the winds blew and beat against that house, and it fell with a great crash. If you go back and read the previous three chapters, there's an incredible invitation in them. And it's very different than the things you see around you. The meek it will inherit the earth. The poor are favored. The people who are on the bottom are actually on top in virtually every way. And... Jesus invites these people to be this incredible blessing to all of the earth. Instead of being worried, we're supposed to ask for whatever we need. Instead of being stingy, we're supposed to be generous. Instead of being hateful and angry when people speak about us, we're supposed to hold our tongues in great respect of God, trusting that the kingdom around us that we see, everything around us that we see that feels so real, is not the greatest reality. It is instead the reality of Jesus. We're supposed to be honest, praying goodness into the world instead of worrying and taking things onto ourselves. Instead of judging, we're told to ask. Instead of going with the crowd, Jesus invites us to go the other way. In the end, the extreme invitation of these passages is to build well. When we choose the ways of Jesus, we're choosing to build on a foundation that will never be shaken. And when the storms come, it will never fall. This house that we're building of our lives can be placed on Jesus, that one firm foundation. And make no mistake, this is a storm. And in this storm, when we build well and when we're holding on to Jesus, we'll be found to stand. We'll be strong. We're going to make it. If we go the other way, we choose not to build on Jesus. We choose to build on our own strengths, the things that we want. This storm might break us. We might fall with a great crash. And I don't desire that for any of us. So I desire 
that all of you will go back, read those previous three chapters, and start to take it into heart, start to take it into your very self, and say, yes, this is the best way to live. This is the way to move forward with Jesus. In the end, we all want to be strong. We all want to be sitting on a firm foundation. Build with me on Jesus. That's my invitation to you, friends. Be blessed in all of this. Amen. Abide with me, Gone, gone, gone the sun.